Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Beer Geek Nation. I'm yours, Chris. Thank you so much for joining me once again for another beer review. And today we are looking at another Smutty Nose beer. This one is again from their big beer series. This is their Imperial Stout, 9.8% alcohol by volume. So it definitely lives up to that big beer series. Smutty Nose Brewing out of Portsmouth, New Hampshire. I don't think this one needs a whole lot of description. It's an Imperial Stout, it's from Smutty Nose. Let me get into a glass, let you guys know how it smells, tastes, and give you the verdict on Smutty Nose Imperial Stouts. All right, guys, so the appearance on the Smutty Nose Imperial Stout, and really th these kind of beers are perfect examples why you need proper glassware. Um, pick up a snifter for your Imperial Stouts. It does a huge justice for it. Black as night, you can't see anything through it, and on the curves of the glass where the light hits it, you get these blood red notes that are just gorgeous. Nice carbonation um, sitting on the bottom of the glass, can't see any light through it. There's a nice eh, finger to a finger and a half worth of a off, you know, white, almost dark brown head on there, chocolate milk looking head. Um, nice tight bubbles in the middle there, kind of dissipates out into bigger bubbles. There's some nice lacing on there. Um, definitely some alcohol feed on this one, 10%, I would expect that, but overall, it's just a beautiful looking Imperial Stout. All right guys, so the aroma on the Smutty Nose Imperial Stout. Wow, big, big chocolate coming through. Espresso, it smells like espresso, chocolate espresso beans. There's definitely a sweetness in there. It's a fruity type of sweetness, a touch of alcohol to help kind of cut those flavors. Massive roasted notes in here. I mean, it smells like fresh roasting coffee, dark chocolate. Yeah, it's just a way, way over the top Imperial Stout. Really, really great smelling stuff. All right, so the taste on the Imperial Stout. Here we go. Cheers. Wow, right at the front of the tongue, huge, huge chocolate sweetness, a milk chocolate mixed with a, blended with this like, like a 75% cocoa dark chocolate. Really, really bitter. Um, there's definitely a nice hot bitterness in there as well, which I'm kind of surprised by. Middle of the mouth, holy crap, this thing coats your mouth with these big chocolate chocolate and coffee notes. Um, just, just literally puts a film on your mouth. Um, this big, you know, velvety, kind of chocolatey, coffee flavored film. You definitely start to get the roasted notes coming through. The carbonation really, really helps to kind of clean the palate. You know, those flavors do kind of coat your mouth for a little bit, but that carbonation helps to move it along. Nice sweet finish, really, really the, the aftertaste in this one are the big sweet notes. It's a sweeter stout, definitely a sweeter um, Imperial stout, but you do get a big, big roasted finish on this one, followed by a slight kind of um, hop bitterness in there as well. Um, wow, all over the place, chocolate, coffee, hops, roasted notes, but wow, they really come together to do a really, to make a really, really easy to drink beer at 10%. You don't taste the alcohol really. There's a slight burn in it and you do take a, get a slight sweetness from it, but overall it's just an easy to drink, epic, epic, epic tasting Imperial Stout. Really, really nice stuff. Well. All right guys, so the final verdict on the Smutty Nose Imperial Stout, 9.8%. To be quite honest, this is one of the better Imperial Stouts I've ever had. I'm gonna give this one a solid, solid A. It's super easy to drink and has all the characteristics that I like to see in a Russian Imperial Stout. Big chocolate notes, coffee notes, roasted qualities, and they really are all present in this one. They're just over the top. You get some hoppiness in there. Um, but at the same time, it's drinkable yet warming, and you know what it is. You do definitely taste that 10%, but it's at no time overwhelming. Definitely a sipper. Pick yourself up a snifter. Um, and it's easy to get, it's cheap, and it's just, it's great stuff. Uh, it's really, really, I think, an underappreciated Imperial Stout. I, I don't hear much about this one. So, you know, in the comments, post, what are some of your favorite, you know, underlooked Imperial Stouts? Let me know, I'd be curious to hear some. So, with that said, guys, Smutty Nose Imperial Stout, getting an A for me. Really, really, really solid stuff. And remember, folks, life is too short. Drink amazing beers. Cheers. <laughs>